Let's have a big hello to the gorgeous Ganga. I was just wondering what to do to make it look like this. I think I did well. Beautiful, royal. I don't know what you're doing, but you're not looking regal or royal. Steady, baby. Steady, okay, steady. One second, just. Oh. Oh. It's week four of the Hunt for the Kingfisher Calendar Girl 2013. There are 10 of you girls left in the competition. And in your last new Tresemme hair and focus challenge, we had you posing atop a giant mammoth, and the brief was for you to transform yourselves into Zulu warrior princesses. Based on the shots that we have got, we're gonna be judging you on three parameters. Balance, poise, and expression. For the best performer, she shall gain immunity from the next challenge and thus being that much closer to winning the coveted title of the Kingfisher Calendar Girl 2013. But for the worse, she will find herself straight in that danger zone. We're gonna take a look at your pictures now and see how many of you actually succeeded in your challenge. First up, we have Runa. Could we have Runa's pictures, please? I really wanted to see how pictures came out because this was our first task with Anushka. Anushka? I honestly felt that you didn't know what to do with your body. Sometimes you got it right, sometimes you didn't. But I think most of the times you couldn't get your body in the right position. So these are the best two pictures that I could find out of the whole lot. Runa, from seeing your previous shots, I actually think this first photo of you is probably one of your best. Again, you actually did the exact same thing that you were doing on the acrylic box. We just happened to get it from a good angle this time. Nivena, you are up next. Actually, they're beautiful. The only thing you didn't do was you didn't pay attention to the brief. It was Zulu Warrior Princess. I asked you to be confident. You just got up there and posed. Next up, we have Kanchan. I was very, very, very disappointed. I'm sorry. I think you were too busy trying to be too hard with this, and it just didn't work. There was, there was no fluid sort of movements in the body. Um, you were very disconnected. The head was somewhere, legs were somewhere. It was very difficult to pick out two shots. Kanchan, every photographer has said that you're improving, you're improving, you're improving, you're improving. This, you have regressed. Next up, Eshra. Eshra, you got some lovely photos here. The only thing is that you're smiling in all of them. The brief wasn't to be happy on this elephant. It was more like you own this elephant. So it was more confidence that was supposed to ooze out and a little sort of sexiness, but still not over the top. Then for this particular task, yeah, you haven't really come across as the Zulu warrior princess riding an elephant in the jungle. Um, with that smile, I mean, you look more like it's a circus elephant and you're a clown on top of it. Next up, Sushmita. Could we have Sushmita's pictures, please? I was confident. I was seriously confident and excited to see my pictures. I kind of felt that your face was very blank, but sometimes it works because it was just like you were looking off into the distance, which is nice because you're riding on an elephant. But it could have been a little more exciting at times. It was a bit dead for me. Your expression wasn't good, the picture wasn't good, it didn't work out. These are the best ones that came. Yeah, also, when I'm looking at these pictures, I'm not getting a sense of ownership. I'm actually thinking that you're like a child sitting on the elephant and you've been playing with it your whole life. There isn't that commanding, goddess-like, you know, power that we wanted. Rupali, can we have her images, please? The angles that I've managed to catch of you are nice. You were up and down a little bit, but I think uh, you sort of came through. I think you listened. I think the face, the hair, the body, everything works. Don't 
get those kind of comments from such a nice photographer. I was very happy to have those comments. Next up, we have Nikki Tasha. I give you full applaud for getting up and standing up on that elephant. It was very brave of you, but um, I think you were so adamant to do that that you lost a lot of time with trying to get other good images. It wasn't supposed to be warrior in that sense that you looked like you were going off into a battle, um, which is what most of these look like. But uh, you did come out with a couple of good images, but they were hard to find. Damn! This entire time, all the last challenges I've done, I've been giving variety. This one time I choose not to give variety, I mess it up, you know? It doesn't get captured. Nibedita, I'm very intrigued to see what you've done, so can we have a shots up, please? This time, I'm not feeling nervous at all, because I think I did well. Actually, I think you did well. I think we definitely got a couple of nice shots. You know what would have enhanced this photo for me? Is a little more finesse in the body. Like, if you were po pointing your toes, if you pointed them all the way, if you were leaning forward, you leaned forward a little bit extra. Just a little more perfection in the body would have made this an exceptional shot. Thank you. Next up is Lynn. Lynn, I think you did a great job. I think you understood what I said. You were very comfortable on top of uh, Ganga. It was great. Overall, it was great. I have no complaints about the shots. Thank you so much. I actually think that your body language and the way that you're sitting on Ganga is really the way that a person that owned an elephant would sit. And you have these amazing eyes, and just the way that you look actually suits this task perfectly. And your tresses are looking pretty good. I was very happy to know that everyone liked my picture and my hard work proved. So that was very exciting for me. Finally, Ishita. Ishita, I think you tried. I think you tried uh, too little. I didn't see anything come out of you at all. I mean, I was, I was already bored of shooting you 30 seconds into it. When the lady taking your picture says that she got bored after 30 seconds, it's not the sort of thing that you want to hear. It's not what I want to hear either. And the last thing we want to hear is that you're not trying hard enough. Because there are thousands of girls who wanted to get into this competition who didn't make it. You're here, and if you're not giving your best efforts, that's highly unacceptable. Ishita, when we say we want you to be a goddess and be powerful, I don't need you to put your hands in the air like this. You look like you're in a school play. Ash, I had a little bit of thought in my mind. I had a little bit of attention to what I wanted to do. So I could do it better. All right, ladies, so we've seen each and every one of your pictures. Please give us a moment. We are going to decide who is the best and who is the worst performer in this challenge. I think that I will go to Dengar because the critic also said that I didn't do good. India's number one news app just got even better. Download NDTV's new app. Fully optimized for retina display. Full screen view. Faster response time. And Sudoku. NDTV's new iPad app. Download now.